Kruckenberg tumours are defined as metastatic carcinoma to ovary with at least 10% of the tumour composed of signet ring cells. At least 70% of Krukenberg tumours arise from the stomach, usually the pylorus. Less common sites include the colon, appendix, pancreas, biliary system, gallbladder, breast, bladder and cervix. The average age at which Krukenberg tumours present is around 45 years old and 90% of them present with symptoms of ovarian involvement and the gastric cancer causing the Krukenberg tumour is usually diagnosed by the time that it presents in the ovary. But sometimes the gastric cancer may present after the Krukenberg tumour is diagnosed. And the prognosis is awful with a life expectancy of one year or less. Around 80% of Krukenberg tumours affect both ovaries. They have a lobulated and solid appearance with a firm pale cut surface. This ovarian mass shows the typical features of a Krukenberg tumour. It is rather lobulated, has a pale cut surface and as we move to the bottom of the picture you can see a centimetre scale. So this is really quite a large tumour, several centimetres in diameter. And here is omentum showing involvement by Krukenberg tumour. Histologically, the characteristic feature of a Krukenberg tumour is the presence of signet ring cells. These may be present in sheets and single cells. They may also form small glands. The stroma is often edematous and fibrous with a desmoplastic response and sometimes the tumour may resemble a fibroma. This is a low power view of a Krukenberg tumour on the left is part of a cystic follicle and to the right of this the ovarian stroma is diffusely infiltrated by signet ring cells. On higher power sheets of signet ring cells can clearly be seen and the intervening stroma is rather fibrous or desmoplastic and at an even higher power magnification you can see the mucin pushing the nucleus of the malignant cell to one side, resembling a signet ring.